yo what's up guys welcome back to the channel and happy new year to everybody and um, we're gonna be talking about the path of the wave storm um this is gonna be my second take i did make a video completed it and instead of hitting stop recording i hit start recording and i lost the whole video so in reality the path of the champions the path of the wave storm that was my first real run i never did it before and i had three keys but as you can see now i only have two keys and i've already three starred the path of the wave storm so this is going to be take two i'm going to redo that video now and i just want to quickly touch up on guild wars we finally finished well we started literally from the bottom and we were like six thousand maybe seven hundred five hundred something like that we we um the guild was made on november 26th so that was like the last day the last day of the previous season that just ended so a month later we started six thousand something five hundred six hundred i don't know we were like at the bottom and we finished 19th place it's incredible um unfortunately the last two out of three wars we had we lost and that's how we kind of ended up in 19th i honestly think we would have been a lot higher maybe even top 10 possibly or at least top 15 but uh war beast 2 and red unfortunately messed us up pretty good <laughs> those are just crazy yields with crazy you know defenders and everything so um we lost to those two and we were pretty much undefeated i think we only lost like two or three battles throughout the whole uh season and um it's just incredible to go from bronze all the way to platinum and i just want to give a quick shout out to everybody in the guild thank you so much everybody like you know for hanging in there and doing amazing and i really appreciate each and every one of you so 19th place and let's see what we do next year um the next season that comes out so let's go ahead and get back to the topic uh, at hand and let me just quickly go ahead and craft these potions and so path of champions we're going to be doing the path of the wave storm and unfortunately this is going to be my second take um this is pretty tough i'm going to go ahead and take my water deck again and this this is pretty pretty challenging um if you don't have a good deck um you have 30 turns to complete it and you know to at least get credit for it but if you want a three star you have to finish it within 15 turns and it's pretty it's pretty tough i would say if you don't have good cards or you're just starting out or whatever the case is like it's not really a walk in the park so let's go ahead and see how i do my second playthrough and i was gonna end up using all three keys anyways on the path of the wave storm and i just got hit by weakened four times like on four different cards um, I am just going to go ahead and pop all of these. And hopefully that kills them off. Yeah, they're pretty tough. Um, I should have just used the Hunter also. Um, let's see here. Hopefully that should kill them off because they're like at a sliver. Okay. But this weekend is gonna suck. I don't think I have a dispel on for it. I don't think any of these cards dispel the weekend. So here, I think I might have to use Thor's ability. Yes, I do. So I'm just gonna tank it and let's see how this goes. Okay, I'm not gonna die, but I do get hit with fear and I hate that. So I'm just gonna go ahead and use everything here this might be a little bit of a better playthrough i'm not sure it took me 11 turns yeah okay it took me 11 turns last time to three star it the first playthrough that i ever did but i guess i kind of learned to activate all my skills and not try to save it because these guys are tough here i just kind of I take a knee like he does and I just kind of die here and use up my free revive and let's see what happens I'm gonna die but hopefully I should have my skills back oh I don't okay well he's on a two turn so I'm just gonna match whatever and I'm just gonna waste this turn here I'm gonna 
waste this turn. And there goes my four star. Uh, my, not my four star, my four tier gem. That sucks. I kind of wanted to hold on to that. Okay. So I'm going to hit this. Okay, at least they spawn together. Hopefully he dies right here. And I don't have to use another. Oh man, do I have to? Do I die instantly? Oh no, I don't. Okay. So again, just gonna match up random gems and just hope to, for my skills to come back. I hate when that happens. Like you're looking at the you're looking at the gems and you just have a feeling like they're gonna get matched when the new gen spawn. Okay, you know what? I'm going to revive here. At least now I'll definitely kill it off. And none of my power gems spawn next to each other. That's great. But he should still die right here. So, yep, that's it. Okay, uh, it only took 10 turns instead of 11. And I'm pretty sure people that have like the Halloween deck are just going to run through this easily. Um, so this time I got 20 gold ore, three water essences, one legend crystal shard. I got a hammer and 250 gems. So I guess that makes up for me spending the 100 gems for the revive. And that's pretty much it. You can see what rewards you're going to end up getting from each of the, the paths, fire, dark, and water. And I'm focusing on water specifically for the water enchanting ruin. I need those to build my elemental hammers. And as you saw, like I have an all water uh, guild versus guild defender lineup and I'm going to be changing that up soon. But for right now, I need those ruins to craft more water elemental hammers. And that's what most likely the bulk of my gems are going to go on. Just farming the uh, the gear dungeon keys and just farming the level to get the, the guardian diamond shards and that's all for this video um i do have the walkthrough for the other path of the champions like the flamebound and the night stalker i do have a video for that i'll leave a link in the description if you need to see how those two are and i do have other videos and guides on my channel so please be sure to check them out i still see a lot of people on the facebook fan page asking the same questions that i've already answered but I do understand that not everybody knows about my channel. So I would really appreciate it if you guys can share my videos with others. Share my videos with your guildmates. Help everybody out. I have a lot of good tips and tricks on my channel. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys learned something new and seeing how, like, I guess tough it is or it isn't. It might be tough for you. It might not be. Um, like I said, it might be a walk in the park for you. If you have the Halloween deck, you're just probably running through these and you know, finishing the whole path in like three turns. But that's all for this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one again. Happy New Year. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.